Hey y'all, Josh here today, AKA the world's greatest dad. And it's always a great day when you get some new lawn equipment in the mail. And today we're gonna do an unboxing and a setup of the EIR lawn aerator. Let's get it. So when you pick this thing up, it's gonna come to you in this nice triangle shaped box, just like this. Looks like it's uh, very well packaged and put together. So let's go ahead and crack into this thing. So we got our box all opened up. Let's pull everything out here. So we got everything all opened up and first and foremost, I gotta say how I appreciate how everything was bundled up and wrapped up nicely in this packaging. You'll see we've got the main piece right there. It comes with this nice little tool to help clean out the unit. There's all our nuts and bolts as well as a tool to put it together. That's gonna to be our set of spikes. And there is where our hands go. And of course, finish off with this nice little instruction booklet. So for step one here, we're gonna go ahead and attach these arms here using these nice Allen head bolts. Simply stick two of those through there. Stick our other body piece on. And we're gonna take our nuts Put those on. Then use our Allen wrench they provided us to go ahead and tighten them down. Next, we're gonna go ahead and attach our handle using two more of the Allen wrench bolts. And a couple more of the nuts that came with it as well. Pretty easy peasy. And we'll go ahead and tighten those down as well. Now they also provide you these nice little plastic caps to go over the nuts. And that just gives it a really nice clean look. Also make sure that you won't catch yourself when you're using this thing. So next up we got 15 of our nail bolts along with our nuts to install. And I love they gave you this nice little tool right here. So basically you can just take your nut, slide that in there. This goes all the way up and you'll be able to snug those up nice and tight. As you can see, this is pretty fast to get these things on. And then when you want to tighten them up, use that tool. You can also use this on the back side if need be. We're nice and tight. Let's get through the rest of them. So we got her all completed and man, does she look nice and sturdy. And I'd say between unboxing, reading the instructions, unpacking everything and putting it all together, it took me five minutes tops. I do appreciate the instructions. They were pretty straightforward. I also appreciate the fact that they provided all the tools that I would need for the build as well. And the last thing I appreciate is the fact that they even threw in a couple extras just in case something went missing. So I'm gonna do a full review here in the future after I play with this thing for a little while and see how well it works. But at least now you know it's easy to put together and something really anybody can tackle. Hope that helps you out.